A gamma ray is a packet or photon of electromagnetic radiation emitted from the nucleus during radioactive decay and occasionally accompanying the emission of an alpha or beta particle. Gamma rays are identical in nature to other electromagnetic radiations such as light or microwaves but are of much higher energy. Because gamma radiation loses energy slowly, gamma rays are able to travel significant distances depending upon their in energy. Gamma rays can travel tens of hundred, hundreds of meters in the air. A better particle is an electron emitted from the nucleus of a radioactive atom. Examples of beta emitters commonly used in biological research are hydrogen negative 3, tritium carbon 14, phosphorus 32, phosphorus 33, and sulfur 35. Some energetic beta particles such as those from P32 will travel up to several meters in air or tens of millimeters into the sky. While, while low energy beta particles such as those from H3 are not capable of penetrating the dead layer of skin, thin layers of metal or plastic stop beta particles. All beta emitters, depending on the amount percent, can pose a hazard in inhaled, ingested, or absorbed into the body. Blaze that. An alpha particle consists of two neutrons and two protons ejected from the nucleus of an atom. The alpha particle is identical to the nucleus of a, of a helium atom. Examples of alpha emitters are ra radium, radon, thorium, and <laughs> uranium. Since alpha particles cannot penetrate the dead layer of the skin, they do not present a hazard from exposure external to the body. Alright, check it. This machine right here <laughs> works to detect radiation, as in the movie P32. One song. That's it.